Hi, my name is Taylor and welcome. Yeah, um, this is just gonna be like an about me video or like an update um, and we're gonna have fun. That was cringy. <laughs> I'm a 15 year old girl. Surprise! Currently inpatient at the hospital for complex regional pain syndrome, CRPS, of my stomach. So basically, I've had CRPS for a long time, but in my leg and now it's in my stomach and it's hard for me to eat or tolerate any food or liquids. So that's why I have a feeding tube. Okay, so I put on glasses because you know, gotta, gotta be able to see. Okay, I'm a varsity cheerleader at my high school and I wanna be a pediatric surgeon when I'm older. I love to travel, it's my favorite thing. I have a great family and I'm gonna be a sophomore in high school. So that's like everything about me. So I was diagnosed with Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome Pots, postural or tachycardia syndrome and complex regional pain syndrome and then I have a bunch of um, other like small ones that are a lot more common like IBS and costochondritis etc um, but my those are my three big ones and um, all of those have kind of contributed to me being here right now which really sucks I'm just gonna start from the beginning. So I grew up like totally healthy. I was a, a gymnast and a soccer player and I, that was my life. Like sports was my life. And then one day, this was May 13, 2017. It was the last competition of the season for gymnastics and I fractured my ankle. Um, and the process was normal after that. Like I was in a boo and a cast and all of that jazz and then um, the pain like I went to physical therapy and the pain was only getting worse and so I had an MRI that showed ankle impingement and I had surgery and they cleared out scar tissue and all of that and then the surgery made me develop complex regional pain syndrome CRPS and I was on crutches for nine months and then we went to a pain rehab program up at Seattle Children's Hospital. I live in Southern California so we had to travel um, and I was there all summer and they got me learning to walk again. Um, but I do still have a lot of pain and, and a lot of, like it's, I still have CRPS but I'm more in remission now so that's good. Uh, the November after the pain rehab program, I got food poisoning. So this was 2018 actually, um, of November. And I I threw up a bunch and we think that that damaged my vagus nerve in my stomach and caused all of my GI issues. So I, ever since then, I haven't had a normal working stomach basically. It just really causes a lot of pain and nausea and uh, bloating and weird bowel movements <laughs> and all of that jazz. <laughs> January of 2019 I was diagnosed with POTS because I was always dizzy and getting blackouts and like fainting you know that fun stuff and and um and then the next summer of 2019 I was diagnosed with Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome that we think caused the CRPS and the POTS. Over the last year and a half since the GI issue started, um, I it's only gotten worse and worse and worse. Then about a month ago, my pain started to flare up really, really badly in my stomach where I couldn't tolerate anything in my mouth. We ended up going to the ER and they admitted me, ran all the tests they could, and then we ultimately, after like two weeks, we decided, okay, you know what? This is CRPS in my stomach. This is, we have to treat it by doing intense pain rehab programs and things like that. And so they sent me up to the MBU, which annoyed the heck out of me. I've been here for three and a half weeks now. And um, here they are basically trying to train my stomach not to be so sensitive to food and liquids. And it is 
a living nightmare. I am in constant pain and nausea and it has really affected me both physically and mentally um, just being here and so it's definitely not fun. Also summer of 2019, so last year, I was diagnosed with rapid gastric emptying syndrome so basically my stomach empties way too fast into my small intestine and causes a lot of annoying symptoms. Yeah. In the future, I'm gonna be doing a bunch of more videos that includes, so this is like my introduction video, I guess, but I'm gonna be doing like a day in a life. I'm gonna explain what EDS, CRPS, and POTS is, and I'm gonna do like a hospital room tour at some point, um, cause who knows how long I'll be here. Oh, and we're looking into going to, we're probably gonna go to Mayo Clinic um, and do their pain rehab program. So I have a meeting in a few days with them about that. So yes, this is all super exciting. I love you all and I hope that you follow my journey and I hope you guys have an amazing day, a low pain day. I'm sending hearts and spoons. Bye. Oh, and subscribe and like because we love supporting creators.